Maintain muzzle awareness. Everyone is a safety. Paratroopers of the 2nd Brigade Combat Team, 82nd Airborne Division, participated in a rigorous 11-day combined arms live fire exercise, or CALFEX. Throughout this CALFEX, commanders of the infantry companies received additional support from across the brigade and 82nd Airborne Division. The brigade support area has been established where we've got all of the brigade's logisticians in the field doing maintenance, doing distribution, doing services. We've got an aeromedevac asset that's supporting us with our casualty evacuation for training. We've got our artillery brothers and sisters out here supporting the operation with fire support. And then we've got our combat engineers reducing an obstacle to allow the infantry to attack. Fire the hole, fire the hole, fire the hole! Both infantry and supporting elements worked together day and night, training with live ammunition as they attacked an enemy strong point. Our core requirement is to prepare ourselves for ground combat and bringing the entire team right here to work our core mission essential task as a team on terrain that we're unfamiliar with and doing that in the heat of the summer, this crucible is how we build trust. Well, each, each platoon has their certain objectives that they're going to do and they rely on each other platoon because if one one platoon fails the mission, then the whole the whole company is going to fail. Because you need everybody working together. Multi echelon Calfex training builds cohesion amongst the different units and a high level of readiness. It's an extraordinary privilege to command the Second Brigade Combat Team and serve with some of the best trained, best led, best equipped paratroopers in the world. No one's got it better than us, and we're working hard day in and day out. In Fort Bragg, North Carolina, I'm Army Sergeant Sean Casey, 22nd Mobile Public Affairs Detachment.